See, I don't even know how this thing works. Okay, so what would you do for me? Number one, you, when, after you got off work from school, teaching school, make sure, number one, the house is clean for you. Number two, make sure your food is ready. Number three, after you got your food, make sure your bath water is ready. And one day I give you grape, one day I give you cherry, one day I give you orange, whatever, 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 whatever color you want in the bathtub. And I would have your night clothes laid out for you. And after that, you know what, what's, what's going to happen. What's going to happen? Mr. Bernardo is going to love you, his wife. So, you would marry me? Yeah, yeah, I would. <laughs> Why would you marry me? Huh? You don't know me. Why would I you marry me? I'm saying that. You said, would you marry me? I said, first thing I would have to put a ring on it, sweetheart. That even if you and I was dating each other, I would still do the same thing. And at all times, you would know who I am. Mm hmm Because if you're out there working, you don't know who I am. That means something ain't right. 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 But one day, could I ever be Mrs. Junebug? Huh? Would I ever be Mrs. Junebug? You can, you, you could, you can be Mrs. Junebug. That would be nice. I like your hair, too. Oh, really? Yeah. It's extensions. That doesn't matter. Hair and everything. It's, it's the hole in what you have up here. My heart is my hair? No, I'm saying... A lot of people think hair and looks. It's not about the looks and no. hair. It's about your vocabulary and your heart. Which two things. I, number one, if my wife could wake up out of the grave right now, she said, I never want to order. I would tell you, I said, hey, baby, I'm going to walk around the block and make sure you're going to cool off.